Oh, my glam! The Radiant Week theme gets announced today! I can't believe we only have a week to plan and build high-concept art pieces. It will be next level. Right, Bella? <laughs> I just hope the theme is fun and accessorizable. <laughs> is that a word? It is now, darling. <sighs> Bella, I heard the theme might be cringe or culottes. I heard it's rotten bananas. Isn't that Brill, Bella? So Brill. Earth to Bella. You okay? I'm fine. Hmm. Things are just a little off between me and Jade lately. I keep hoping we can work in the same Radiant Week group, but we haven't even had a chance to talk about it. I don't even know if that's how Radiant Week even works. Well, I'll cross my fingers to the fashion fates for you to work with Jade. It's time for the Radiant Week theme selection ceremony. Oh, I forgot to pack my special ceremony outfit. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, it's time. It's time. Radiant Week is Rainbow High's cutting-edge creative celebration. The sky's the limit. As long as you stay on theme, projects must transport visitors into a fantastical realm of out-of-the-box, show-stopping, innovative creation. In short, you must wow me. And the special surprise guest judge... This only happens every three years, so... For most of you, this is your one and only chance to make Radiant Week history. Herstory. <laughs> your team's reflection of the theme is crucial to a successful Radiant Week project. So, without further ado, the theme selection ceremony. Your fierceness. And this year's Radiant Week theme is Perspective. Ooh, such rich inspiration! For Radiant Week, you can choose your team or choose to work alone. And with that, Radiant Week begins now! Jumpy! Do you want to team up? Yes! Let's do it! So, I think I want to work solo. You good with that? Phew! <laughs> well, I was talking with Brianna about some animation stuff, and I was hoping to team up with her. Hey fam, the music video went so well, we decided you can join us for this project too. We could use more musicians for our project, if you're interested in joining us. Me! Jade, you'll be joining us, Avi. Thanks, but I'm planning... <gasps> Jack Dawson, Robin Sterling. Robin told me about your makeup skills. We'd love to have you. Whoa, wow, I uh, was hoping to work with Belle, but uh, yeah, I'd love to work with you. Come ladies, our fortune's calling. Are you like uh, working with Jade? If not, you should work with me and G. Yeah, let's do it. Let's work together. Jade doesn't want to work on our masterpiece? Well, then forget her. Sorry, not sorry. Exactly. Hashtag thank you next. <laughs> our fashion squad will crush this competition. Hey. Can we talk about our groups? Talk about what? Your group seems all set. It's Jet Dawson and Robin Sterling and, and, and. They agreed you should join us too. Oh, they're gonna let me join? No thanks. I'm already part of a group that wants to work with me. You're passing up our chance to work together? I vouched for you. Sorry I didn't make the cut before your stamp of approval. That's not what I meant, I... <sighs> And what concepts are you exploring? 
how fashion allows you to change your own perspective of yourself. So we're thinking like one of those apps where you cut and paste outfits onto someone's image? Groundbreaking. Uh, but with a big twist of something. An existing app means it's been done before. The point of Radiant Week is innovation. Think outside the box. Transcend the box. It's all been done, and nothing adds a new perspective. With so much creative freedom, I thought Radiant Week was going to be a piece of cake. Hey, 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 what if everything was literally a piece of cake? Yikes. I feel like we need an army of mannequins to even start to fill this giant space. An army of them? Ugh, creepy. This reminds me of my time with the famed Acrobats of Toronto. And with this tech, we will definitely transcend. If we don't, I won't be associated. Oh, these wires are fried. Don't stress. You code. I'll be right back. Hey, Jade. Um, uh, I should get back. Yeah, me too. Jade, wait. We need to talk. Maybe we can hang while we work on our projects. Yeah, okay. That works. I wanted to say, I get why you teamed up with Robin and Jet. I don't get why you didn't want to join us. I worked with the people that I knew wanted to work with me. I did want to work with you. I just also want to work with Jet and Robin. When you signed up to work with your roommates that you see all the time, it made me feel like you don't have time for me anymore. I don't have time for anything. I just, <laughs> I've been really busy. We're not working together. We never see each other. We never talk. We're supposed to be best friends and we basically haven't hung out since you got back. And dude, I don't even know how you got back. No one does. What about that thing I heard about how you stopped a heist and put out a fire and got a medal of honor for saving Rainbow High from an alien attack? Look, getting kicked out is not something I'm proud of. So when people ask questions about how I got back in, I just let them believe whatever story they want, even a crazy one about aliens. But if you want the real story, I'll tell you. Meet with your groups for pop-up mid-process evaluations by Ms. Wright. Beginning in two minutes. <sighs> to be continued later? Mm-hmm. Whoa. What happened here? Choosing a background for my authentic perspective project. I'm not sure I would call a green screen background authentic. It's just a placeholder. Trust the process. <laughs> well, everything is cake is a bust. Yeah, everything is burnt cake really lacks magic. And flavor. We need a new out-of-the-box art form. <laughs> Amaya? Are you okay? <laughs> what language is that? We were up first for our eval with Miss Fright. She said she doesn't know what our project has to do with the theme of perspectives. She... she hated it! Oh, she didn't hate it. She just told us to think bigger. So we will. Wait, bigger? That's it! Daphne, come on! We got some big work to do. Wow. <laughs> Those are the longest eyelashes I've ever seen. A bit formal for 8 a.m., though? Uh huh. Yeah. It seems my eyelash strips are water, cleanser, and uh, tug proof. I gotta create some kind of heavy duty remover thing. 
Maybe while well, you tell me a story? <sighs> when I was kicked out, I was heartbroken. I knew you were right and I should have listened. In one dumb move, I gave up my dream of being at Rainbow High for the teeny tiny possibility of being chosen to intern for Ramona Barnes. I wasn't sure if I could fix it, but I had to try. So when my mom picked me up, I convinced her to take me to try and get my application back. Wait, wasn't your application emailed? <laughs> no, Ramona Barnes is old school. She wanted hard copies, sent in the mail with stamps and everything. Wow, vintage. The mail was already on its way. So we went all the way to NYC to try and get the envelope back straight from this Barnes. Whoa, you went all the way to her show on Broadway? Did it work? Barely. Then I overnighted it back to Rainbow High and left a very carefully worded voicemail asking Miss Wright to reconsider my expulsion. Just kidding. I called her every single day for a month, begging and begging her to reconsider. And then... And then... Attention! Report to your locations and teams for final run-throughs. Oh, come on! Again? We can be five minutes late, right? I repeat, drop what you're doing and get there. It's final run-through time. Uh, fine, we get it. Mm. I need more glitter! Another rewrite, River? What happened to Amprovise? But you said you would send me those pics. Holly rejected another piece. Who does she think she is? Shh, shh, shh. Don't let her hear you. So you begged and pleaded for Miss Wright to let you back in, and then what? She agreed? <laughs> yeah, right. She said she would consider letting me back in, but wanted to make sure I experienced adequate consequences for my rule breaking. Ouch! That sounds intense. Yeah, community service for the whole term. And I polished the unicorn statue. Every weeknight, porn detail. That's a, a lot. But doing the work means I get to be back at Rainbow High, so it's worth it. Wow, thanks for telling me. And uh, now that I think about it, the unicorn has looked extra shiny lately. <laughs> I've really, really missed you. you. All right, all-nighters. Time to put those finishing touches on your projects. And maybe shower for the first time in a few days. Radiant Week begins in one hour. But for now, good luck. I mean, turn your color up. her radiant cast already? Before we officially begin, I'd like to introduce a very special guest judge of this year's Radiant Week, legendary Broadway designer, and a dear friend from our own days at Rainbow High, Ramona Barnes! No <laughs> way! <laughs> Miss Barnes and I will decide the category accolades, including one very special surprise prize. Ramona, will you do the honors? Let the radiance begin! At an elite school like Rainbow High, it can feel like our decisions are under a microscope. Our project embraces that and shifts perspective to put every tiny detail on display. Oh, nice. 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 
Sometimes the things you see every day can inspire if you just look at them in a new way. Come and join us! <gasps> that is so cool! Oh, Interesting. I used similar technology for my interactive staging of Little Women just last year. I've been here for like half an hour! I can't believe no one's come in here yet! Don't people need to fix their makeup during Radiant Week? <gasps> Back by popular demand, our smash hit, a winter tale of two super beautiful enchantresses. At this time, the way we always intended it. Starring us in every role. That is so cool! That was unreal! What does this have to do with perspective? <gasps> For our Lux Spiderweb, we sourced a rare fabric from Indonesia. Delicate, but strong. Just like a spider silk. The pressures of school can make you feel like a fly trapped in a web. But shift your perspective. You can become the one spinning it. And the trap becomes a tool. Ahem. I, I do need help. I don't get it. They just made a normal room? What, it, what the? Welcome to our room. It may look three-dimensional, but it's entirely made up of custom art. Airbrushed in fine details to look hyper-realistic. Even that neon sign is painted. We decided to use forced perspective to make you question if you can trust your eyes or if truth itself is an illusion. Hmm. Inventor. But still wet. I don't just hear music. I see it. Everywhere. We wanted to show what that's like from my perspective. So we made it possible to rock out using anything and everything. I just don't get it. How do you stay so positive all the time? I don't tell you often enough how much I admire you. All of you. Thank you for coming to this feelings and fashion meeting. As long as I have my friends, I don't need anything else. Isn't that right, Bella? Oh man, I gotta get out of here. Miss Wright, would you like to be our volunteer? Most mirrors just show your look from a single, flat perspective. Ours can show you, you, from all angles, so you know that your look will turn heads and open minds. As an influencer, I'm all about being authentic. But the time I've spent locked in this bathroom has given me the perspective to see the truth. I'm a fraud! I once posted a selfie with hashtag no filter, but I totally used a filter. My son kids trip to Cali. Background swaps. I never meant to lie to you. I did it for the lie. Wow. An impressively raw look from Miss Willow. Hello? Is someone there? Please, Miss Wright, I need a chance for a redo. My project was- Truly a change in perspective. I'd love to see it on the Broadway stage. Brava, Miss Willow, brava. Thank you so much for this award for outstanding solo piece. And I would like to remind you that everything I said or did during my time in that bathroom was all part of the plan to, uh, help change your perspective of influencers. Up next is the award for most engaging show, which goes to... P 
Poppy, Daria, and Rainbow Dream. What? Thanks for the award. We'd give a speech, but we like the music to speak for itself. And for our final prize of the evening, one we're aptly calling the Hit the Road Award. This team's innovative technology gave us all a fresh perspective to see reality from new angles. Congratulations, Bella, Cheryl, and Gabriella for your all angles holographic music. <laughs> And for that hit the road part, your team has been chosen to go work on a very special project at Rainbow High Sister School, Pacific Coast, in Malibu. Uh, Malibu? I hate that. 